Welcome back to Crafts by Susie Cardmaker. Today we're going to do another number four in our house mouse series called Umbrella Shade. Um, I'm going to just play music through all the Copic coloring and I will catch you on the flip side and we will talk about everything from there. So, enjoy!
Hi, I hope you enjoyed the Copic coloring portion of this. Now we're going to get out our powder tool and some just some cheap yellow cardstock. And I'm going to prep it to keep any oils and to keep the uh, embossing powder where it belongs. I'm going to ink it up with some Versamark and stamp my sentiment. And then I'm going to use some uh, Carnelian. It's by Recollections. It's pretty orange red. It'll go really nice with the umbrella. And we're going to heat that up till it turns nice and glossy and then you know it's ready. It takes a couple minutes, but like I said, it'll turn nice and glossy. And then we're going to trim it down to about one inch wide. And we're going to keep the length because we're going to wrap it all the way around our house mouse piece. So I'm going to go ahead and, like I said, we're going to wrap it around the house mouse piece. And we've trimmed that down. And then we're going to put, secure it with some just some scotch tape. We're going to put some foam tape on the back of the house mouse piece. Our card base is another, pe is another piece of that yellow card stock. It's pretty heavy duty, but it's cheap and I don't even know where I got it from. And then I took some of the Perfectly Plaid from Lawn Fawn and trimmed it down to make a mat for my card. And I'm going to adhere my house mouse piece to it. And we added some glass, we're going to add some glossy accents to the ice cube and to the one seashell. Um, I don't know if you noticed, but when I was doing the Copic coloring, the sand, a lot of dots gives it texture and makes it look actually like sand. So now I'm going to adhere some various sequins that I've gotten from probably Joann's, um, some orange and some iridescent sequins, and I'm securing that to my card with some glue dots. I will link everything I've used down below and in my blog I will have all the individual Copic colors that I've used for this. Um, I'll try to link them by what I used on what portion, like what greens I used on the glass, what warm grays I used on the mouse. I'll do that in my blog. So check that out. After we get all the sequins secured we're going to go ahead and take some orange slice and firefly stickles and just put little dots on top of the sequence and that will conclude the card for today or this week actually i hope you enjoyed please come back again and we'll see you later bye